Looking back now, what I really liked about the culinary arts program at Walla Walla Community College was it emulated a real world restaurant environment. Um, it was not easy, but it set my expectations for the career ahead of me. And um, particularly one of my favorite things was ice carving. Uh, the, the instructor that started the program was an avid ice carver, very good. And uh, he passed some of those skills along to us students and I've been using those to this day. One of my funnest memories in school was our ACF conferences. We went to Seattle and Salt Lake City. We met chefs from all over the region, took some awesome workshops, and made some really great memories with my fellow students. I really appreciate being here in this area because the community has a strong sense of support for people like me. There's a ton of great farmers around here where we can basically act like being a vertically integrated restaurant from farm to table. There were instances where I really wanted to be challenged more and my instructors recognized that so they pushed me harder which made me a better chef. I definitely wouldn't be here I think without community college. I, uh, we did everything from lab work to cellar work to bottling, um, labeling, you know, all parts of the, you know, of the industry that you would not be able to learn in any other place. Uh, just to go to school and to be in the cellar or to be crushing grapes, uh, it's, it was unreal. I don't think that you know, I, I could have started my career any differently. It, it gets more intoxicating the more uh, you do it, so, uh, and you get more um, inspired. So that helped to keep your, your interest going throughout the two years. And so I think that's the main thing to me. And the instructors, again, Mike and, and Stan, were, were very uh, passionate about what they were teaching and they were very involved with the students. So that was also what kept your interest and kept you wanting more. The community college with um, the practical aspect of it and the hands-on nature of the school and the program allowed me to hit the ground running. I'd already had a previous degree and was committed to moving forward in the wine industry and this allowed a real expedient process to do that. Also with all the connections that Stan and Miles had within uh, the community and outside the Walla Walla community in the state of Washington. Uh, really facilitated a lot of great relationships that have continued to prosper. Walla Walla Community College helped me in very many ways. I mean, the, one of the big things they did for me was being able to piece things together. Having great people like Stan Clark, the Figgins family, all involved in this uh, venture uh, really helped me basically put it all together. The passion was there, but without their support, I wouldn't be here today. The biggest impactful statement I think the Stan Clark made was you can't make good wine from bad fruit. So when you get good fruit, your job is to not screw it up. And those words have stuck with me and, and, and that's it. I mean, it's, 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 it's get good fruit, don't mess it up. Salud.